Hey guys, how's it going? I'm just going to say spoiler alert now. So if you have not been up to date with The Flash, you don't know who Reverse Flash is, any of the spoiler, plot twist things or have you, leave this video now because I don't want to ruin it for you. But if you're staying until this, this point, I'm going to assume you are updated with the show. So this has to do with Professor Wells slash Professor Zoom slash Reverse Flash. Uh, this is his backstory slash motivations for the CW show. Um, it kind of leaked online, like during an interview or something like that, in one of the original, um, in one of the scripts, I guess, it leaked online. So, essentially, um, Eobor Thawne is from an alternate timeline where he, you know, is the reverse Flash slash Professor Zoom, and regularly, regularly battles Barry Allen, aka The Flash. In this timeline, Barry is married to Iris, and they have twins called the Tornado Twins. Uh, Barry's mother is alive and still happily married to, you know, Barry's father. And also in this timeline, Thawne is Barry's arch nemesis, you know, vice versa, naturally. Uh, Thawne's powers come directly from Barry as he sucks the energy from Barry, the Speed Force energy, in order to run at super speed, which is, you know, like the comics. Now, Thawne hated his timeline's version of Barry so much that he went back in time to kill Barry's mother and frame his father to extract his revenge, which is how we have the current timeline that the Flash is in now before Barry did the time travel thing um, and two episodes ago, as of now, um, when I'm you know recording this. So, um, like I said, Don hated his timeless version of Barry so much, he actually went back in time and killed Barry's mother, yada yada. However, young Barry hadn't yet gained his powers, and therefore, Ebor Thon couldn't use his own speed for very long as he needed Barry um, to have his powers in order to do so, which was obviously a flaw in his plan. So, Thon, over the course of 15 years or so, Bill's a particle accelerator, you know, Star Labs, all that stuff. And the accelerator allowed him to use Barry's energy, because Barry got his powers, obviously. So Eobard could eventually travel back to his own timeline. Uh, this is essentially, you know, Thon's motivation or Wells' motivation throughout the whole season, um, at least, you know, currently. And, um, yeah, all he wants to do is get home. But he wants to do everything, I guess, that he can do to also hurt the Flash. Um, and... This is basically how the show's going about with their Eobor Thawne interpretation. So my thoughts on it, uh, brief thoughts, is I'm totally fine with it. I think they kind of humanized Thawne a little bit because the Eobor Thawne I think about, I think about the one where he's like, it was me, Barry. Like, you know when your dog randomly was in the middle of the road, got hit by a car? That was me. You know how you had no best friends? That's because I basically erased all of them from existence. You know how you fell on the stairs at one time? That was me. I pushed you over. So I'm kind of used to the Eobor Thawne that basically wants to do everything possible to make Barry's life living hell without killing Barry or making the timeline deviate too much. But um, yeah, this one this is pretty cool. I'm totally up for it. I I do think that uh, there's definitely you know staying true to you know certain central aspects about the character. The only thing I want to know though is obviously Wells is from the future, so and it seems a few centuries into the future. So in the in the original alternate timeline, I guess you know where Barry's mother isn't dead. You know, my only question is why is Wells in the past in the first place? Are they going to go into that? Like, are they going to do something where it's like the original comics where he was like basically obsessed with Barry Allen, the Flash, stuff, stuff like that? So um, this would be pretty cool to see. Also, it'd be really cool to see if in this alternate timeline we have Wally West because if they want to do Wally West, you know they could. Do it alternate timeline, mamma jamma, you know, shuffle, whatever have you, and just be like, yeah, Iris has had this nephew this whole time. Awesome. Because when you think about it, obviously Barry and Iris would not have grown up together in this situation, in this alternate timeline, because Barry's father would have never gone to prison. So comment below what your guys' thoughts, and I'll see you guys later. Oh, hey. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed what you just saw. I don't know what exactly you just saw, but I hope you guys enjoy it. And if you really did like it, go check out our other stuff. You know, we have social media, Facebook, Twitter. The link should be somewhere here. Also, we have other channels too. We have our movie video game channel. We have our music channel. Obviously, our comic book channel too, because we know we do all that entertainment awesomeness. We also have a website. Go to our website, hypernetworkyt.com. And check out our other videos. Uh, that's all I really have to say. It's Josh, and you know I hope you guys enjoyed you know what you watched.